Okay, and welcome back. It's that time of the week for the NRL predictions for week three. The, yeah, week three. Whew, it's going to come and go just like that, unfortunately. Uh, oh, well, there's still the EPL and the NFL season, so I might do an NFL predictions. But that won't be till like, February. I don't know. We'll see. Week two recap. I was going to say the week two. We had the Roosters versus Bulldogs. I don't even know why those those games should have been played. Roosters smashed the Bulldogs thirty eight to twelve. That was always going to happen. I did not watch any of the games, so I'm just going off by scores here. So yeah, well for this week's predictions anyway. The other game we had the Cowboys versus the Sharks. <laughs> if some of you remember, I had the Sharks as the underdogs. Kind of was hoping they put more of a fight. They lost thirty nine nil against the Cowboys. Huh. Well then, moving on. So that would bring my week two predictions from uh, to two from two last week. Like the AFL, I got two from four. The first week? Yeah, so I'm getting more confused on the weeks. It's week three. Whoa. So yeah, so all up on four from six. Yes, that sounds right. Four from six, which isn't too bad. I mean, it's kind of the first time I've actually done something like this. So moving on to this week's games, we have on Friday night, my team, dun, 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 the Brisbane Broncos versus the Roosters, Suncourt Stadium, in Brisbane. And... Broncos should win. Tight game. Should be about two points in it. Broncos are fresh. Roosters coming off a big victory. So if it's... If any team smashes the other, I would be very surprised. And if the Broncos don't win, I will do a challenge. There, I've done it. I've said it. So you guys listen to challenge for me and I'll do it if Broncos lose by more than six points. So not six, no. So like seven or more. Then I'll do a challenge. You guys decide. I'll probably pull a, a poll up or whatever. But yeah, that's my challenge for that, for this week. On Saturday, down at Amy Park. Yeah, Amy Park, we have the Storm versus Cowboys. Again, same thing with the other game. Storm are fresh. Cowboys came off a big victory. It's going to be close. If it's not, something's up. Not something's really up. This whole Cowboys have this thing is like, oh, the refs cheat me out of the finals. Ugh. That shouldn't happen this week, although it did happen in the past. But anyway, it all comes down to how they play. But Cowboys are off a big victory. Storm are fresh. As much as I want the Cowboys to win, the Storm will win. They should win by eight points. Alright, I'm going to throw that out there. By eight points, the Storm will win by. So, you know, it's kind of more of a veteran side. It's got, you know, your state of origin players and that. Or your elite players, so what can you do? Sometimes it's the the age and wisdom of players. Kind of also true for Cowboys. And you have some state of origin players there. But anyway, what can you do? So that would mean we would have a Broncos versus Storm grand final which would be awesome if there was no new south wales team i believe in 06 when the broncos last won their premiership storm was in was in that grand final i believe it was a broncos storm someone can correct me please correct me or prove me right one of them but yeah so it's kind of like if those two verse each other it's like almost Ten years rematch, a ten year rematch, I think. I hope. I'm praying. I'm just gonna be quiet. That is the wrap of week three. I will see you next week for the grand final week. We will kind of do. Get, we'll probably get more into depth. Maybe I don't. I don't know what I've decided for it yet. But until then. I will see you later like an alligator. I'm gonna stop seeing so. Goodbye. One, two, three,